Hello, today we show you how to uh, create uh, two planes and uh, coordinate system on a uh, four axis horizontal milling machine. And you can see we have a tombstone fixture here with a park located on this. And the first thing you need to do is uh, select the machine. Yeah, you got a mu D4 millimeter. Uh, we change it to a four axis horizontal. Click on the file and select replace the button. You can select the right machine for the job. In KA, we select the four exit the XMC. Okay. Uh, the master cam uh, 2017 uh, is really uh, new to me, so I will do it uh, not so quickly. All right, we select the machine. And the simplest way to create two plane on a four action machine, even vertical or horizontal, is the you will create a corner system, have the same origin point, and it must be located on the rotary axis. Yes, that's the simplest way. For example, I do this for you to see. We move to the wireframe, we create the line. Okay, for example, the rotary exit uh, is aligned with the tombstone fixture, and uh, yes, you can see. You can see here, yeah. And oh, sorry. That's pointy the uh, rotary axis center. Yes, the rotary axis, the y axis. We go through this point, and this is the rotary point. We will create the tool plan based on this point. I mean that the x direction and z we can select based on this point and y uh, you can uh, select uh, wherever you want. Okay, for this part you can see we have one, two, and three face face need to mill. We will start with the top face first. The top face we will mill this. The slot we will create a a tune plan for this face. You can use available a top uh, tune plan, but if you don't want, you can create a new tune plan for this face. Okay. Uh, normally, it will display the plan tab here. If you don't see it, you go to the view menu and uh, select the plan button, and you can see that the the plan tab is displayed now. So you can see we have six uh, available assets. Uh, tool plan. You can skip it. You you don't want to use. It. So I will create the first tool plan for the top face of the park. I create. Click on the create create new plan button, and I select uh, solid face. Then I select the top face of the park. Yes. Uh, don't care about the position of the origin. We will uh, move it later. So you can see we have the Z, X, and Y in the right direction. You can change it if this not right. But this right now, so we okay with this. So we will name for the tomb plan, for example, top face. Oh, sorry, top face. Okay. We create a, the tomb plan first, and then we uh, move it later. We move it to the uh, rotary uh, center, rotary point later. Okay. We got the top face again with the same. Procedure: We uh, create a new tomb plan 
okay again from solid face I clicked on the the 40 uh, 45 degree on the left yeah you can see the Z uh, direction is right but uh, X and Y are not right so we must change it until it go to the right direction so this is the right direction you can see the Z the X follow this and the Y in the right direction so we click OK and we name it again this uh, is B45 okay don't care about the position of the origin we will move it later as I told you so now we have two tomb plane the top plane the B45 and we create one for this face that B minus 45 uh, okay click again from solid face yes again we, you need to select this until you get the right direction okay it's right now when you got the right direction for the exit you click OK and you name it B minus 45 OK and so you can see we have three tomb plan with right direction yes you put it in the right direction first and the second you move it to the location you want and I told you before the simplest way to uh, select the origin on a multi axis machine is the move the origin of a tomb plan to uh, the rotary center of the table for this example for example we can uh, move the top top face first to move the tomb plan origin you select the tomb plane and then right click and then click edit yet yeah, we can freely move it for example I want to move uh, the origin the the Y origin to this face I click on this around it green around so I can move move the origin I select this set so the origin we move to this face I click OK. Yeah, you can see that the top fade Y origin now move to the top uh, to this fade of the park, and then, uh, or you can uh, move the X and Z first. We add it again. You pick it and move it to the rotary. Exit first. When you got the X, X and Z in the right position, you move the Y to uh, the location you want, where you want. For example, you want to set the the Y on this face, so I click on an entity on this face, and OK. So now so you can see that we have the top plane in the right direction and with the origin point located on the rotary exit of the, the table of the fixture so it will be the simplest way to create a tomb plan so we done with the top face and the B45 degree we do the same I right click and select edit I move this origin to the rotary center okay and now I move the Y the Y position to uh, the design uh, coordinates okay same with the top uh, face we can select the Y origin on this face okay yeah so we get top face B45 yeah they have the same uh, origin point but different uh, direction okay next for the B45 uh, minus 45 we do the same 
or move this to the rotary center and then click on the green around to move it on the y direction and you can select this face or any 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 uh point you want maybe center of park maybe center of the park yes whatever you want okay so you can see I finished create a coordinate system for three tool plane the top face the B45 and the B minus 45 they have the same ori origin point uh, and that's point located on the rotary table or oh, sorry the that's point located on the uh, rotary exit that's the uh, y exit in this case so it will be easy for us to create the program and to export the program to the machine yeah you can even uh, set the for example the origin of the P45 you can select uh, edit ok you can move it to this point any point you want but the problem is uh, how you find that point after the, the table rotate so it's uh, not an easy job so the simplest way as I told you is move all of the origin point to the rotary center of the machine yeah the rotary center of the table that's the simplest way yeah. in the y x you can move freely any anywhere you want you can select at the center of the park yes it's not uh, create a big trouble because we can easily find that point when we know this face and this and this face so we can easily find this point but when you select on a, a type of pay like this we are uh, difficult to uh, uh, locate a point to machine uh, other operation so the quick uh, and the fastest way the easiest way to uh, put the origin point on the rotary exit of the table okay thank you for watching bye bye